This is PCOS Jess. Uh, PCOS and my name is Jess. Yes, this is a very blonde wig. No, I would not look good in a very blonde wig or with blonde hair at all. Uh, my face is too red for starters. But you know what? At least this kind of shows me uh, what hair color not to dye it. <laughs> I like dressing up um, in costumes. It's fun, you know, either at conventions, at homes, just for shits and giggles. Um, but at the same time, that kind of thing, this whole wig business, could actually become reality, uh, which is kind of scary. Because, you know, as some of you may know, that um, we're kind of messed up in the sense that uh, we can grow hair on our face and other parts of your body. Uh, for example, I don't know if you can see, but I'm kind of growing a 5 o'clock shadow right now. And um, at the same time, we can lose hair on our head. You know, I mean, that's kind of retarded. Um, that's the whole masculine feeling. I mean, like, shit, like, <laughs> can I just take this hair and put it up here? I wish, but it doesn't work. Um, I noticed that when you take birth control, it is supposed to regulate your menstrual cycle, but some birth control can actually apparently cause hair loss, which I read online, so don't, like, quote me on that. But I did notice that this year my hair is starting to thin out, and when I went to a salon, the lady said the same thing, and now I'm not on birth control anymore, because <laughs> I am definitely afraid of um, losing my hair. Uh, more than I am of getting my menstrual cycle regulated. Um, maybe I have my priorities messed up, but as a girl, right now, um, I need my hair. Um, I think wig shopping would be pretty cool. <laughs> you know, uh, expensive if you want to get really good wigs, um, more natural ones. Um, but I'm not ready, you know. I'm 25 years old, and uh, I don't want to take that route right now. But it is a reality, girls, so... Um, you better get uh, get used to the feeling of wigs, you know, because it might just happen to you. If you do notice your hair is starting to thin out, uh, that's when you have to start, you know, maybe looking into some treatment methods, implantation methods, or like me, wigs, because I can't afford any of those. Alright, anyway, that's all I have. Oh, I guess I'll show you what I'm talking about. I don't know if you can see, because it's on film and it's harder to see, but um, I used to have really thick hair. I don't know if it'll show. But now, um, this isn't as bad, but the actual hair itself, like, the amount of hair, I can't explain it. Maybe you can see for yourself. I don't know. Can you see anything? Is this helping? And